Picture this. Millions of bright red strawberries growing in perfectly aligned rows, stretching as far as the eye can see. But we're not in some sunny California field. We're inside a cutting-edge greenhouse where technology and nature work together to create something extraordinary. Welcome to the future of farming, where a single greenhouse can produce more strawberries than 50 traditional farms combined. Did you know that the global strawberry market is worth over $20 billion? Or that a single, high-tech greenhouse can produce strawberries 365 days a year, defying seasons and weather. Today, we're pulling back the curtain on how modern farmers are revolutionizing strawberry production, turning science fiction into delicious reality. I've divided this video into four essential parts to make it easy to follow. First, we'll explore why strawberries are more than just a sweet treat, diving into their remarkable health benefits and countless uses. Then, we'll look at the mind-blowing numbers behind the global strawberry trade. Trust me, these stats will make your jaw drop. In our third segment, we'll step inside state-of-the-art greenhouses to see exactly how these juicy berries are grown year-round. Finally, we'll reveal the advanced automated systems that are transforming an ancient farming practice into a high-tech operation that looks more like a smartphone factory than a farm. So whether you're a farming enthusiast, a tech lover, or just someone who can't resist a perfectly ripe strawberry, stick around. You're about to discover how a simple berry is teaching us to reimagine the future of food production. Let's dive in. The Power Packed Berry Uses and Benefits Let's start with something that might surprise you. Inside each juicy strawberry lies a powerhouse of nutrition that rivals some of the most expensive superfoods on the market. These ruby red gems aren't just Instagram worthy, they're practically nature's multivitamin. A single cup of strawberries packs more vitamin C than an orange, making them your immune system's best friend. But that's just the beginning. These berries are working overtime for your health. They're loaded with antioxidants that fight aging and disease, fiber that keeps your digestive system happy, and potassium that helps maintain healthy blood pressure. And here's the best part. They do all this while containing just 50 calories per cup. Talk about a guilt-free snack. Beyond the fresh fruit aisle, strawberries are culinary superstars. Walk through any supermarket and you'll find them transformed into jams, jellies, syrups, and even premium cosmetics. The food industry can't get enough of them. They're in your yogurts, cereals, smoothies, and even high-end skincare products. That distinctive strawberry flavor has become so popular that it's now the third most preferred flavor worldwide, right after chocolate and vanilla. But here's something you might not know. Strawberries are also workhorses in scientific research. Their unique genetic makeup and growing patterns have helped scientists develop better farming techniques for other crops. Some companies are even using strawberry extracts to create natural food dyes and preservatives moving us away from artificial alternatives. The demand for these versatile berries isn't just growing, it's exploding. And that's exactly what we'll explore in our next segment, the fascinating world of strawberry economics. Stay tuned to discover why farmers are racing to build more greenhouses and how some are making millions by meeting this insatiable demand. Behind the numbers, the strawberry economy. Now, Let's talk numbers. And trust me, these aren't your garden variety statistics. The global strawberry market has exploded into a $20 billion industry, and it's still growing. Just last year, farmers worldwide produced over 9 million metric tons of strawberries. That's enough to fill 3,600 Olympic-sized swimming pools with strawberries. But here's where it gets really interesting. Despite this massive production, we still can't keep up with demand. In major markets like the United States, Europe, and Asia, strawberry consumption has been climbing by about 5% every year. Premium supermarkets now want strawberries on their shelves 365 days a year, not just during traditional growing seasons. This year-round demand has created what industry insiders call the berry boom. Let's break down what this means in real terms. 
A single modern greenhouse operation covering just 10 acres can produce the same amount of strawberries as 50 acres of traditional field farming. Not only that, but these greenhouse berries are consistently perfect, bright red, uniformly sized, and blemish-free. This quality control has led to premium pricing, with greenhouse-grown strawberries often selling for 30 to 40 percent more than their field-grown counterparts. The numbers get even more impressive when we look at the efficiency of these operations. Traditional strawberry fields might yield 15 to 20 tons per acre annually, but a well-run greenhouse, they're hitting 40 to 50 tons per acre. Some cutting-edge facilities are pushing those numbers even higher, reaching up to 60 tons per acre through vertical farming techniques. And here's a statistic that's changing the game. While traditional strawberry fields can only harvest for three to four months of the year, greenhouse operations are producing and harvesting for 10 to 11 months straight. This extended season isn't just good for profits. It's revolutionizing how we think about local food production. Countries that could never grow strawberries commercially due to harsh climates are now becoming significant producers. The market dynamics have created a fascinating situation. Despite the higher initial investment needed for greenhouse operations, we're talking several million dollars for a state-of-the-art facility. The return on investment can be as quick as three to five years. This explains why we're seeing a surge in greenhouse construction worldwide with over 1,000 acres of new strawberry greenhouses added globally just last year. But all these numbers lead us to an important question. How exactly are these modern greenhouses achieving such impressive results? That's exactly what we'll explore in our next segment, where we'll take you inside one of these high-tech growing operations. Get ready to see strawberry farming like you've never seen it before. Strawberry farming in greenhouse technology. Step inside one of these modern greenhouse facilities, and you might think you've walked onto a spaceship. The environment here is so precisely controlled that every single factor, from the air temperature to the amount of CO2 in the atmosphere, is monitored and adjusted in real time. This isn't your grandmother's greenhouse. This is agricultural technology at its finest. Let's start from the ground up, or should I say, from the air up, because surprisingly, these strawberries aren't growing in soil at all. They're suspended in sophisticated hydroponic systems, growing in rows that stretch up toward the ceiling. This vertical arrangement isn't just for show. It allows farmers to grow up to 10 times more plants in the same floor space as traditional farming. The growing process starts with carefully selected strawberry varieties that have been specifically bred for greenhouse production. These plants are placed in specialized growing channels filled with an ideal substrate mixture, usually a combination of coconut coir and peat moss. Each plant receives its own precision measured feed of water and nutrients through individual drip lines, ensuring not a single drop is wasted. But the real magic happens above the plants. Special LED growing lights supplement natural sunlight, providing exactly the right spectrum of light that strawberries need to thrive. These lights can even trick the plants into thinking it's summer in the middle of winter. The entire ceiling is equipped with automated shade screens that adjust throughout the day, protecting plants from excessive heat while maximizing natural light use. Temperature control is crucial and these facilities maintain it with incredible precision. The ideal temperature for strawberry growth is between 65 to 80 degrees Fahrenheit, and sophisticated climate control systems work 24-7 to maintain this range. But it's not just about temperature, humidity, air circulation, and CO2 levels are all carefully monitored and adjusted through a network of sensors and computer-controlled systems. Perhaps the most fascinating part is the pollination process. Instead of relying on random visits from outdoor bees, these greenhouses maintain their own colonies of specially bred bumblebees. These industrious pollinators work year-round, ensuring nearly 100% flower pollination rates, something that's impossible to achieve in outdoor growing. Disease and pest management takes on a whole new meaning here too. Rather than spraying crops with pesticides, these facilities use biological control methods. Beneficial insects are introduced to control harmful ones, creating a natural ecosystem within the greenhouse. 
Combined with the controlled environment, this approach results in strawberries that are not only perfect looking but also largely free from tkwamical ECDs. The results speak for themselves. While outdoor strawberry plants might produce fruit for a few months, these greenhouse plants produce continuously for up to 11 months of the year. Each plant can produce up to 2.2 pounds of perfect strawberries, compared to about 1.1 pounds in traditional field growing. But even with all this technology, we're not done yet. In our final segment, we'll reveal the cutting-edge automated systems that are taking greenhouse production to even greater heights. Get ready to see robots and artificial intelligence transform strawberry farming into something straight out of a sci-fi movie. The future is now. Advanced automation in strawberry production. Welcome to the most exciting part of our journey where artificial intelligence meets agriculture. Remember those science fiction movies showing robots tending to crops? That's not fiction anymore. It's happening right now in modern strawberry greenhouses. Let's dive into how automation is revolutionizing every aspect of strawberry production. At the heart of these facilities sits what farmers call the brain, a central computer system that makes thousands of decisions every minute. Imagine an AI that can predict exactly when plants need water, adjust light levels before clouds even move in, and maintain the perfect growing environment 24-7. These systems are so sophisticated, they can even predict crop yields weeks in advance with 95% accuracy. But the real game changers are the robots. Gone are the days when harvesting meant dozens of workers carefully picking each berry by hand. Modern facilities now use automated picking robots equipped with 3D cameras and soft grippers. These machines can identify ripe strawberries by their exact shade of red, gently pick them without bruising, and sort them by size and quality, all in one smooth motion. A single robot can harvest up to 1,000 berries per hour, working tirelessly around the clock. The irrigation system is equally impressive. Each plant has its own sensor monitoring moisture levels, nutrient uptake, and root health. When a plant needs water, it essentially asks for it through these sensors. The system then delivers precisely measured nutrients and water directly to that specific plant. No waste, no guesswork. This precision has cut water usage by 90% compared to traditional farming while improving berry quality. Climate control has reached new heights too. AI-powered systems create microclimates within different zones of the greenhouse. If strawberries in one section need more humidity, while another needs more ventilation, the system adjusts automatically. UV sterilizing robots patrol the aisles at night, preventing disease spread without using chemicals. Some facilities even use drones that fly through the greenhouse, scanning plants with thermal cameras to detect potential health issues before they become visible to the human eye. Perhaps the most fascinating innovation is in quality control. As strawberries move along automated packing lines, AI-powered cameras inspect each berry from multiple angles, checking for over 20 different quality parameters in a fraction of a second. Perfect berries are automatically packed for premium markets, while slightly imperfect ones are redirected for processing, all without human intervention. These automated systems aren't just about efficiency. They're about sustainability, too. Energy usage is optimized through predictive algorithms that consider weather forecasts, energy prices, and plant needs. Some facilities have reduced their energy consumption by 40%, while increasing production by 25%. The precision of these systems means nearly zero waste. Every resource, from water to nutrients, is used exactly where and and when it's needed. Looking ahead, the future seems even more promising. Researchers are developing new AI systems that can adjust growing conditions based on predicted market demands months in advance. Imagine strawberries that can be programmed to ripen exactly when prices are highest. Some facilities are even experimenting with personalized growing conditions to enhance specific characteristics like sweetness or vitamin content. If you found this journey into modern strawberry farming fascinating, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Drop a comment below telling us what surprised you the most, and let us know what high-tech farming operation you'd like us to explore next.
Whether it's vertical lettuce farms, automated mushroom growing, or something else entirely, see you in the next video, where we'll continue exploring the future of farming.